hey guys what up i'm back again with another tutorial it has been crazy since my summer classes started i've had a lot of projects since things have been tied up exclusively and because i have a limited amount of time for classes all of my projects are backed up back to back but aside from that i have another tutorial for you this time i am going to be dyeing my hair with two different colors one from manic panic and one from silk elements mega silk you know silk elements mega silk semi-permanent hair color the two colors i'm going to be using are manic panics vampire red and silk elements burgundy brown i absolutely love burgundy brown my favorite color out of the silk elements hairline um color line but anyway i'm going to be using those two colors to dye my hair i usually just mix them together in my hand and i don't wear gloves by the way as you might have noticed in the video I don't really like wearing gloves because I like to feel out any spots that I've missed on my hair and I feel like gloves get in the way of me actually doing that. Now I'm not bashing anybody who wears gloves. If you wear gloves, great. That means you don't have to worry about your hands getting stained. But personally, I don't care about my hands getting stained at all. But anyway, I don't wear gloves. So I just go ahead and put, take out a certain amount from the jar, from the manic painted jar, and I squirt a certain amount in my hand from the Silk Elements bottle, and I just mix them together with my fingers, with a finger, and then I just slap this stuff right on my hair. My hair has already been co-washed, so that's why it's been sectioned into different sections and everything else, and it's still kind of dripping wet. I'm not sure if you can see it in the video. But I sectioned it so I can make this whole this whole process easier. So I'm gonna slap the color in my hair, and yeah, I will get back to you in a moment. So I'm just now getting started rinsing out my hair in the sink. I'm sorry if the video showed up really yellowish. I was actually trying to get the white balance correct on that and I had a bit of a problem with that but I apologize for that. But anyway I'm rinsing out the hair color and I absolutely love the results. The results were spectacular especially since I didn't bleach my hair. I just slapped this stuff on anyway. But the results were amazing and I would absolutely try this again so yeah i'll show you a picture of it i'll show you a little clip of what it actually looks like and the picture by the way is what i took with my smartphone after i applied my leave-in leave-in conditioners which were the kinky curly not today 
leave-in slash detangler and the shea moisture jamaican black castor oil leave-in conditioner i had that in for extra protein but yep that's how the color came out and thank you for watching this short tutorial of sorts and i will have more videos in the future so i will see you soon